Hello, this is evangelist Dr. Robert L. McKim Sr. from Carrollton, Ohio. Again, these uh, internet trolls, hackers, are still at it because they don't know how to stop. That's their problem. They, they, they just don't know how to stop. It, it's like an addiction to them. They're addicted to make, you know, lying and making fun of pe uh, good Christian people because they think they're more right than I am. God's Word says to be angry and sin not. But these people are angry at me, they hate me, and they're sinning. No other way to put it. They're sinning, and they love to sin. They love to sin. Bottom line, they love doing what they're doing because they don't know how to do anything else for the good except lie, cheat, and steal. Everything that goes against the Ten Commandments that they say, I'm breaking. They're the ones that's actually breaking. They're lying, constantly lying about me. They're stealing photos from my Facebook page that I found out that I cannot protect. They're in a certain um, album on my Facebook page that I cannot protect. All my other albums are protected. And now I just found out that uh, they um, even went in in uh, my son's Facebook page or my ex-wife's Facebook page, I'm not sure which one, and stole a, a, a photo from uh, their Facebook page. They just love to go onto Facebook pages and steal people's photos. They think it's they think it's their right. Well, it's not their right. Someone else's Facebook page photos is not their property. It's not your property. And it's not free, free, um, for everybody to take and use as their own pictures. It's not. I changed my password to my Facebook page, but I know how you're doing it. You're going in through one of my friends. That means you have to be their friend to get into my Facebook page. So I'm warning my friends right now, check your friends. Check your friends to see if they are not somebody who hates me. Ask them. Ask them. Of course, they probably won't tell you the truth. Because they're liars. God's Word says one thing, the one thing that God really, truly hates the most is a lying tongue. Or how about a lying fingertips, lying fingertips on the internet? Because where does lying start? Starts right here in the heart. Starts right here in the heart. The lies start here and go to here and out through here or out through here. The lies start in the heart. Your heart 
not the one that actually beats the blood, but your heart of hearts, your spirit is dark and evil. That's the only way I can put it. You're pretending to be a friend of my, my friends. Where you're actually an enemy. It's like uh, the Trojan horse. <clears throat> and they let you in so you can attack me. See, this is what I do here. I wanted to show you here uh, what they've been uh, doing. And then this is what I do to save all the um, everything that they're saying. This is um, This is uh, John Anders Stan, and I uh, use a clip, the clip um, or snipping tool, and then I save. Because I have a lot of what they do and what they say. And of course, he's saying that I uh, confirmed that uh, I paid Amish Man twenty dollars. Well, no, I didn't pay him twenty dollars. I have the receipt. I paid him thirty three zero three zero. He only charges five dollars a sheet for the scraps. Five dollars a sheet for the scraps. Twenty dollars for the good metal. I didn't get the good metal. I got the scraps that he had. So let's get that straight. John Anders Stan. I didn't uh, give him $20. I gave him $30. I have the receipt to prove it. I'm not showing it because I'm not that stupid. I'm just showing what you're saying. And another thing too. He did not work on Sunday. Because actually the guy I bought the metal roofing off of did not do the work. It was Willard's brother who also lives in the trailer park here. The Amish man did not do the work. So, yeah, you're lying. Lying through from your soul to your brain to your fingertips. And you're probably spreading a lot of lies out of your tongue too about me to people that you meet. And then you're going on here too. Also said that um, <coughs> he can lock his FB down as much as he wants. Bob seems to forget the photo evidence collected by the Carroll County District Attorney when persecuting him for making death threats against public officials all at all a matter of public record with the photos easily accessible with a complete Google search <coughs> or a <coughs> poke around the Carroll County web service that's the big deal 
First off, I'm not threatening any county officials of Carroll County. I have not, get that straight, not threatened any officials of Carroll County. If I have, I would have already been charged and in front of a judge and in jail. I have not. Get that straight. If I have to go to the district attorney and tell the him that you're saying that they have been that what you're saying, and then they're putting lies about him and other officials of Carroll County on your blog. And you're getting pictures of my mother. God rest her soul. Before she passed away of a plastic anemia. You got pictures of my friend who passed away of cancer. You took pictures of uh, my mother's uh, grave. And you also have uh, a picture of my son and his girlfriend, which I do not have on my computer at all. I don't have that one on my computer, not on my, not on my Facebook page at all. My mother and my parents' grave and, you know, other things I got on here. <laughs> but that picture there of my son and his girlfriend is not on my on my uh, Facebook page. <sighs> you know what gets me is when you're taking pictures of people who have passed away to use as your avatar and taking a picture of a gravesite to use as your avatar goes to show how low and evil that you can be. There is nothing good whatsoever about you. Nothing good. Everything about you is evil. Now it's going to stop. Because, yeah, I'm contacting the FBI. I'm going to be contacting my local authorities, and I'm going to tell them, oh, by the way, I'm supposed to be making threats against you, according to these liars, which I am not making any threats against anybody. But mark my words, God is my avenger and he will avenge me because he blesses me he will also avenge me god bless you have a blessed day